from New York, it's theCUBE, covering Blockchain Week. Now, here's John Furrier. Hello everyone, I'm John Furrier here on the ground, actually on the water in the Majesty Boat here in New York City, part of Blockchain Week New York City. I'm here with Maggie Zhu, who's the who's a business development at Decentral. They launched a huge party here. We're on a four-story boat. It's like the Titanic, but it's in New York, New York City. Hopefully it won't hit any icebergs, but no icebergs ahead in blockchain. Thanks for joining me here on the water. Cube interview. Thank you, John. It's actually really funny. You mentioned Titanic. First time we came and saw the boat, we we're like, oh my gosh, this boat look exactly like Titanic. Let's really do something about it because Decentral is really about technology, about being forward. And so yeah, we I think we pulled a very crazy party right now. So tell us about the event. This is a really cool event. How big is the boat? Just give us the details. You ran the event. So I know it's hard to run these kinds of events. A lot of moving parts. You're giving away two Aston Martin cars on a bracelet that's going to light up and turn off based upon if you won or not. So if you, is it, how does it work? Okay, so this boat has a thousand people on here right now, plus our team member, plus boat people. So we have about 1,100 people here. And this whole event was run in the last five weeks. The team has been working so hard. And right now, this bracelet that you see, it syncs with the music. So beats per second, it syncs the colors and everything with the music. And at 11.45 today, we're going to be giving away two Aston Martins. The bracelet will dim down one by one. And the five bracelets that are remaining will go on the stage. Everyone's going to cheer up. The crowd, we're really going to get everyone, you know, cheered up. And this is not just like, you know, us giving away Aston Martins. This is really about bringing the whole blockchain community together. We want to be say, hey, this is a small community. Let's all get united. The cars are just a way for us to thank all our partners and everyone that's on the boat. You know, and I, I get a little nervous when I see these kind of launch parties because it reminds me of the dot-com bubble. But what's different about what's going on with Decentral is you guys have a business that's up and running. This is not an ICO. There's no fundraising going on, you guys are actually executing, and this is important because you guys are doing this as a community. Take a minute to explain the role of the, the blockchain community for you guys and how important that is. All right, so if you think about a blockchain community right now, we have the different coins, we have the different exchanges, the community is very fragmented, and that is unfortunate because, you know, someone like my mom doesn't really understand the term blockchain or cryptocurrency. But at the same time, it's kind of like internet 2.0, where you know these technologies are so new, there's a lot of people who are so passionate, I'm one of them, <laughs> and just like, we just want to spend every day trying to make this better. So Decentral's role is really about, okay, let's do all these partnerships. So we have over 100 partnerships, almost 200 now, all signed, and these are the people that we work with like every single day. And what kind of partnerships are they? Are they code development together? Is it open source? Are they okay. using the JAX platform? You guys made some significant announcements today. Yes, um, yes. The JAX, Liberty, yes. the Cube, so, Ice Cube, yes. for cold storage. Oh. I like the Cube name. John. Um, not, <laughs> not to be confused with the Cube, as in the Media Cube, us. But this is a unification strategy. Talk about the news. What did you guys announce tonight? All right, so today we announced two things. We announced the JAX Liberty, we announced the JAX Unity, and then we announced the other things but that are part of that whole Decentral project. So the JAX Liberty is the platform, it's kind of like an app store. All of our partners are going to be part of this app store and we're just going to have over 200 partners and more going on onward and every single dApps and integration will be here and we'll make it kind of like a game for the new users. Okay? What's the value proposition for people to join the network, the, the well, platform? Well, it is a free platform. We're not charging anyone anything and you know we're probably going to do that forever. So for us, the model here is really about bringing all of these different projects together, whether it be exchanges, whether it be cryptocurrency wallets, whether it be different news sites, encrypted messaging, all of these things that touch every part of our life. We want to say, hey, we want to bring freedom and power back to you. And freedom to us is really your ability to control the information. You know, I'm very impressed with Anthony. Obviously, I interviewed him a couple times uh, in the Bahamas, and he's got a great vision. And one of the things that he talked in the presentation was kind of, I won't say buried, but I think is the most important, notable thing is that he talked about a new internet infrastructure. Okay, And the wallet is central to this new internet infrastructure. You guys are doing something really pioneering where you're actually creating a unification around infrastructure in network effects with currency. 
this is a super important thing. Do you guys, is this part of your mission or is this part of a, um, just part of the product in, in your mind? So our mission, like I said, is really about bringing freedom back to everyone. Right now, if you think about, you know, how Facebook has our social data, how Google has our browsing data, all of these different entities have our data, and we feel like that's really the only way. So what Decentral is doing is we're saying that we want to create a one platform yeah. where we can bring all of these different partners together, and in doing so, we're able to allow people to, you know, just being able to take control of their life. That That is our mission. We want to empower people. So your pitch basically is join Decentral. If you join Decentral, platform you join the community that wants to unify that's pretty much sounds like the pitch yes we want to empower people and we want to unify the whole blockchain and the world community now you talk about your background how did you get here I mean like did you just wake up one day and say hey I'm gonna get in the blockchain I mean what's your background you got a legal background yes. how did you get here so uh, my background is in business and then business law so I practiced for two years as a business lawyer May not look like one, but <laughs> can check my record. Um, and then you're a recovering lawyer, so that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, recovering. Um, and then, uh, so what I really want to do is all about impact. I went into law school because I wanted to do a lot of impact. I realized a lot of it is one on one, not really doing it. Went to technology, and I thought I found my passion. And then I found blockchain. I was like, oh my gosh, like, this is it. This is really, you know, I, we are sitting at the forefront of a technology that might be able to just change millions or billions of people's lives. And a lot of it, people are talking about it. People are not really explaining it properly or building things properly. I felt like Decentral was really at the forefront to make sure that is being done. That's awesome. What are some of the partners you guys have that are notable? Can you share some of the names and what they're working with you guys on? So uh, we're from Toronto, Canada, proud Canadian. And um, in Toronto, we have Aeon, Nuco. They're a uh, interoperability blockchain space. We have Polymass. They do security platform. Um, we also have BRI, the Blockchain Research Institute that's led by Tap Scott. Uh, you know, he wrote a very famous book. Uh, we also have a Shift that's, you know, just doing the KYC, AML. We also have the big ones like Coinbase, like uh, just a lot like Block, that's the consulting firm. We have a lot of different partners that are just like the, all the tier one ones because of Anthony's background, because of our experience in the space for the last four years. People trust us, people trust our wallet, people want to be part of our thing and be part of our mission. Well, we're on the water. We're going to let you go back to all the partying and schmoozing that's going on. Uh, great event. Thank you for putting it on. And, and I think the community is very, uh, very robust out there right now. We're having a good time. Yes. Outside <laughs> is like a zoo. <laughs> and I'm really excited that you're here and we're able to meet some of the really great people and you can interview them. Maggie, thank you for coming on the Cube on the water. Okay, with the new Cube product, Decentral, Unified Decentral has a new offering. Cube is here covering it. I'm John Furrier, your host. Thanks for watching.